Ever puzzled over what fire actually is? Is it a thing, an event, or perhaps a process? If these questions have sparked your curiosity, then you're in the right place. Today we're diving into the fascinating world of fire, unraveling its mysteries and learning how to tackle it effectively. Fire in its most basic form is a chemical reaction. It starts when a flammable or combustible material in the presence of oxygen and heat undergoes combustion. This process involves the rapid oxidation of a material which releases heat, light, smoke and various other products. This is what we see and feel as the flames of a fire. But not all fires are created equal. Did you know there are five different types of fire, each classified by the fuel that feeds them? First, we have Class A fires, the kind you might encounter during a typical camping trip. These are fires fueled by ordinary combustibles like wood, paper, or most plastics. Then there's Class B fires, which involve flammable liquids such as gasoline, oil, or grease. Class C fires are a bit more modern as they involve electrical equipment. Think of short-circuited machinery or overloaded electrical outlets. Next, we have Class D fires, a rather uncommon type that involves combustible metals like magnesium, titanium, or sodium. Finally, Class K fires are specific to cooking oils and fats, usually seen in commercial kitchens. Understanding these classifications is crucial, as each type of fire requires a specific extinguishing method. For Class A fires, water or foam fire extinguishers work well as they can cool the fire and soak the materials, preventing reignition. For Class B fires, foam, dry powder or carbon dioxide extinguishers are effective. They work by creating a barrier between the fuel and the oxygen supply, effectively suffocating the fire. Class C fires require a non-conductive extinguishing medium, so a carbon dioxide or dry powder extinguisher is an excellent choice. Class D fires, due to their uncommon nature, require a special powder extinguisher designed to smother and cool the flames. And for Class K fires, a wet chemical extinguisher is the best bet. It creates a soapy layer over the burning oil or fat, cooling it and cutting off the oxygen supply. In the face of fire, knowledge is power. Understanding what fire is, knowing its types, and how to tackle each one effectively can make a significant difference. Remember, while fire can be a useful tool, it can also be incredibly destructive if not handled properly. Fire safety is everyone's responsibility. Always ensure you have the right tools and knowledge to handle a fire situation. So the next time you light a match or see a flame, Remember the complex chemistry at play, the different types of fire that exist, and the specific ways to extinguish each one. Fire, a fascinating phenomenon, a powerful tool, and a formidable foe. Stay informed. Stay safe.